Hi, in this video I'll guide you through the process of assembling the Gamma Tutor. The components that are needed include a USB mouse or a wireless version of the mouse. Secondly, you are going to need an HDMI cable for connecting the Gamma Tutor to the monitor. Please ensure that the HDMI cable has identical ends which are male to male as shown here. Also make sure that you are using a speaker aux cable, the 3.5mm version, not the larger version. Lastly, you are going to need a display device which can be a computer monitor, a projector or even a TV screen. To properly connect the device, we need to understand the most important parts of the Gamma Tutor. This is the power port which is used to connect the charger or the Gamma Tutor to a power device. This is the HDMI port which is used to connect the Gamma Tutor to a screen, TV or even a projector. This is the aux slot which is used to connect to, a, to earphones or even a speaker. This is the USB port which is used to connect the wired mouse or a wireless mouse. This is how the power port or power source should be connected to the power port. Next, the HDMI cable must be properly fitted as shown here and show that you have fitted it properly as indicated. This is a USB cable for the mouse which is also properly fitted here and make sure that you insert it as illustrated. Lastly, this is the aux cable which is also shown here to be properly fitted and you should ensure that this also is the case. Now for the computer monitor, you make sure that you've connected the power source as illustrated here. Also, you must make sure that the HDMI is properly fitted and is not loose at, you know, at all. If everything has been connected properly, we expect that the Gamma Tutor will automatically power on and it will show a boot up screen that looks like this. Now the next step is to remove all the clutter and make sure that your device has been properly organized and this is the view that it should be having on the screen after the boot up process has been completed and your Gamma device should look like this without a lot of clutter and this is exactly how you expected to assemble the device. Thank you so much for listening. See you next time.